Hi, I'm Dr. Alan Frankel, and I'd like to speak with you about the use of cannabis in the treatment of chronic pain. I think most of us are very familiar with chronic pain of some sort or another, and we certainly have friends and family members who are completely incapacitated due to their chronic pain. I'd like to separate chronic pain into two types. One is skeletal, like a shoulder, um, an elbow, arthritic hand, a, a bad knee, a disc in the back or the neck, versus neuropathic pain. Neuropathic pain is when there's been some irritation and damage to the covering, the myelin sheath of nerves, and patients get extremely uncomfortable, burning pain with numbness, tingling, and it's with them all the time. The patients with neuropathic pain at the bottom of their feet have difficulty walking, they lose their balance. And to further make things worse, there are not very many good treatments in the Western formulary for treating neuropathic pain. Narcotics in general distance people from the pain, but doesn't really get the pain. There are certain other pharmaceutical medications that do help some people, but most patients with neuropathic pain have had inadequate therapy. The drug, uh, Sativex, made by GW Pharmaceuticals, is a one-to-one -one CBD THC extract that's used as a spray. We use very similar medicines and we generally use them orally in capsules and have found it to be more effective, particularly for orthopedic pain. For neuropathic pain, the success rate has been um, higher. The studies, again, using Sativex, which is a whole plant, one-to-one -one extract, show significant benefits in treating neuropathic pain. In particular, which is a big group of patients, are patients that have neuropathic pain that can be suicidal pain, as it's called, because it's so severe. And these are caused by various chemotherapy drugs, other medications, or toxins. We've had better results with neuropathic pain caused by drugs or toxins than we have with neuropathic pain caused by pinched nerves. If you are on any medication that has the potential for causing neuropathic pain, I would seriously consider taking CBD. If you would like more information regarding the use of cannabis in the treatment of chronic pain, please check out my website or call my office for a consultation.